This is Will Nunziata, New York City-based director and creator of theater, television, and film. And today I am thrilled to be speaking with the acclaimed artist, Joel Bryant. But before we get to our interview, here's a sneak peek at his incredible talent. Fresh as hell when I pull up to the scene. Cameras flash like I cover magazines. Always on my flow, even in my dreams. I was made, but it's it is in my jeans. Late night sex, but you're staring at your screens. I guess this world is more broken than it seems. Hidden pains masked with desires. A hidden cave built with things desired. Yeah. Tell the truth like I'm Spike Cohen And I pour these bottles out like I'm Lindsay Lohan Whiskey glasses stacked up like Morgan Wallen Swinging hands in the paint like I'm Ben Wallace Bitches love me like I own the whole palace Flows fire and I can't show malice A broken world filled with broken waves Broken people stuck in broken ways A broken world filled with broken ways Broken people stuck Well, hello, Joel. How are you? Doing good. How are you? I'm good, thank you. And I'm so excited to finally be meeting you. And I'm excited the audience got a little sneak peek of your original tune, Broken Waves. Talk to me a little bit about how you came up with the idea for that song. Oh, uh, well, I, I heard the beat and it kind of honestly was one of those that just came to me. Um, There's a lot of uh, certain kind of hidden messages in there too that I wanted to get out. And obviously the, the diss at the end. <laughs> I love it. And I'm also curious, Joel, where did you grow up and when did you realize that you wanted to be a part of the music industry? Well, I grew up in upstate New York and then around like 10 years old, I moved to North Carolina and then kind of started to fall in love with music there a little bit. And then it really happened when I moved to South Carolina, probably about junior year, just junior, yeah, junior year. I started really was like, you know what? I've been writing lyrics since I was like 10. So let me actually try to turn it into something. Was, do you then, remember the yeah. first song? Do you remember the first song you ever wrote? I don't, honestly. I used to have it all <laughs> scratched out on paper, but I lost it in, in the transit. <laughs> wow, it's okay. Um, I know. It's all good. Now, Joel, obviously this has been a tough time for all artists, but I'm curious to know for you, how are you able to keep your creative juices flowing throughout the pandemic? Uh, lots of inspiration. Honestly, a lot of times I'll get inspiration just from listening to music. So it'll be like, my brain goes stale. I'll just like, stop trying to write. And then it'll just let me just listen to music. Let me just not think about it for a second. And then it'll just come to me. Absolutely. Um, what's the most exciting thing that you're? What's the most exciting thing that you're most excited about? Great job, Will. Um, I need another cup of coffee <laughs> with that question that was about to come out. What are you most excited about, Joel? when it comes to performing live again? Uh, just the uh, the overall experience of being live. Um, growing up, I did theater, so I kind of am used to being on the stage a little bit, and then uh, I got to get used to it again because it's been a while since I've hit the stage, so. Oh, please, it'll be like getting back on a bicycle for you, um, especially when you come from the theater. <laughs> That's my bread and butter. I love it. Did you have any favorite yeah. roles growing up that you played? Um... I mean, I did Mad Hatter. That was fun. <laughs> I love it. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, Joel, final question for you. Um, and I want to let everyone know, for more on the incredible Joel Bryant, you can read more about him right below this video. Joel, if you had to give your younger self some advice, what would it be? Uh, honestly, I have no <laughs> I haven't thought of that. Yeah, so you didn't think, you'd, you didn't think you'd be getting the Barbara, <laughs> the Barbara Walter questions. Well, I mean, no, I didn't. I wasn't expecting. Uh, if you had to give advice to any young artist out there, what would it be in terms of, you know, um, following your bliss? Any young artist, uh, make sure you research. <laughs> That's a lot of what I had to do is just research and try to learn about, uh, especially things in the industry, make sure I'm not falling into certain traps. And yeah, so just make sure you double check everything. <laughs> 
Absolutely. Well, listen, um, I'm so grateful for your time today, and I'm excited that we're connected now, Joel. Thank you for your time today. Thank you. Thank you.